hi guys i am hyras and welcome to my channel today i'm going to show you a very detailed process on how to make burkina other people call it yakri or dege a popular Ghanaian street drink made of millet and yogurt so if you want to see how i make this from scratch to the end kindly watch this video to the end and please do me a quick favor by subscribing to my channel like this video and share this video as well the ingredients for this recipe are millet and if you already have the millet flour it's fine if you don't we will make it together don't worry about that and next evaporated milk vanilla essence or any flavor of your choice condensed milk the late yogurt or the late sugar so now let's prepare our millet flour by first of all washing the millet very well by using this process to get rid of the sand in the millet so i'm going to continue this process till i'm done with all the millets I say, can you all see the sand extracted from this millet by using this process to wash it? I'm washing it very well with my hands to make sure there's no dirt left on any single millet. So after this, I'll use a strainer and transfer all my millet into it for the water to drain very well. Next, I'll get a tray and put on some kitchen tissues on it. And spare my millet and make sure I spread it very well for it to dry easily. Transfer it into a blender and grind it into a rough texture.
pour them and let fly in a bowl and add a pinch of salt you can add nutmeg or ginger powder to it it all depends on you So I'm going to dampen it slightly with water to form small lentil sized balls by rubbing the damping flour with my hands and I'll continue doing this and you might need more or less water depending on the texture of your millet flour so make sure to add the water gradually and be rubbing it gradually to form the lentil sized balls so i'll continue with this process till i'm okay with the consistency if you don't have time to go through this whole procedure you can get the already made millet couscous at the supermarket and be free and if you don't get some you can go through this procedure at the comfort zone of your home and be sure of what you are taking inside My millet couscous is almost ready. So it's ready now. I already have my water boiling on medium heat and I'm going to put on my sieve on the water and transfer the millet couscous into it. I'm going to use a foil to cover it to prevent the vapor from escaping and I'll cover it and allow it to steam to, to soften it. And make sure to stir it from time to time to ensure it's uniformly cooked. I'll cover and wait for it to be cooked very well. It is well cooked now and I'm going to transfer it on my tray and allow it to cool down. As I'm waiting for it to cool down, I'm now going to mix my milk and yogurt.
make sure to mix it very well or you can use your hand mixer to mix it for proper consistency now add the millet couscous to the yogurt base and stir very well you can add less millet and if it's too thick too you can add some milk to obtain your desired consistency mm, this burkina looks so yummy if you haven't tried this burkina yet please do because you are missing on a whole lot so serve and enjoy and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel like this video and share this video as well and make sure to check on my channel for other amazing videos and please don't forget to turn on your notification bell to get you notified anytime i drop a new video bye bye